So what exactly is a post processor? Well, really it's just a text file. So um, text files are different than say a Word doc, although Word documents are also referred to as text files, but an ASCII text file specifically is a text file that doesn't have any formatting to it. Um, so if you're used to creating Word documents or documents using a program like Word or WordPad, those applications actually put in the background, they put formatting characters in there. And so the raw text that's stored in the file has all of this other information that's stored in there as well. Well, post processors don't use that extra formatting information. And in fact, they will corrupt the file format. So for those of you that are familiar with like Notepad, um, or there's a program called Notepad++, which we'll cover a little bit later, um, those are an ASCII style text editor. And when they save the file, they don't add different font information and, and formatting information in with that file. So those are what you're gonna have to use. So where do you find post processors? So, in the installation directory, once you install the Bobcad Kim products, uh, we create a data folder that is stored typically by default in the Bobcad Kim data directory right in the root of the C drive. And then there'll be a subdirectory for the product version that you're running. Um, and then under that uh, product subdirectory, there is a post directory. And under that directory, um, then you have, for example, mill or lathe or mill turn, and then the post processor files are stored under there. So one thing to keep in mind is that a post processor, there could be a single file in there. Um, the current post processor file extension is .bcpst. Um, however, if you have a post processor that has extensive modification um, and there's advanced posting pages added to it, there could be um, additional files stored in that location as well.